Uh, my name is Zaria Mahbub. I am a tech female CEO in Afghanistan, and I'm also a philanthropist that are working uh, to empowering the women uh, and girls in Afghanistan through technology. I have a vision to bring equal access uh, to education through the technology for the women and girls in Afghanistan. I have been uh, spending many years working on technology, working with modern technology and social media, and I really believe that uh, technology can bring social change. It's not about government, it's about society. We don't, I don't think that we have a dictatorial government. We have a society dictatorship. I mean, the men that they are in the society and conservative leaders that they're trying to restrict it. They make situation in a way that you can't access. You think that it's bad to have access. And uh, many of the conservative leaders or local Taliban spread this idea that uh, uh, the internet uh, provides bad values. These people needed to restrict information and control on what's going on. Because this, then when you don't have enough education, you do whatever they want. You can really with easily lead them. Mm -hmm. And you can just tell them, okay, go and kill because you can go to the par paradise. And then they will do it. And uh, that's why uh, they are restricted. What technology can help? You give her access to the information, it's gonna bring changes. I had the opportunity in 2003 when I back to Afghanistan to go to internet cafe, the only internet cafe in Herat. So that's I think that they changed all of my life. For many girls in Afghanistan, we have very small world. Our world is very, very small. It's just in our village or our city. We are not supposed to talk outside of the, our relatives, close friend, and only the women and only men in our family. And if I remember some of my classmates when they talk with the men, they're shaking their body if they talk with the, even their teacher that they are male. They never had this opportunity, and the family not love them. It's because very conservative uh, society. So internet gives them a different idea. If you see these girls that for the first time go online, you can see literacy, the changes in your face. You can see with. If, I mean, in your eyes, you can see they open to the new world. Social media has changed people and it's give them courage. Once it's like, especially for those girls that they are very curious and but they are also, they are shy and the society not allow them. Once they get it that the, the shy is gone, then you get courage and you want to do and you don't want to do whatever the society says or the family is telling you. So it's bringing the changes and more important, Many of these girls depend on whole of their lives depend on men. But with this technology, finally they can realize some of them financial literacy. And it is, the, it has the power to dramatically change a conservative society see and treat women. If women can use their skills with respect of the tradition and, uh, and so, uh, tradition of the society and culture, they, they can make money and they can bring it to the home, it's a huge change. I, I am very positive. I think that maybe we have a couple of more years of uh, war and uh, a struggle, but if we give access, the right access to technology, and we have a, our, our new government really work on a strategy, a right strategy, we might have a different country in the next 15 years. The girls around the world deserve to have a tools to imagine a better life. Maybe the problem seems big, but uh, solution starts small.